We're here with Ben Keating, driver of the number 33 uh, Chevrolet Corvette C8R. Um, first, we have to ask, what's with the hat? Uh, I, I, uh, I just pulled in here from Paris, and uh, as soon as I walked up to uh, the administrative checks, the team handed me a cowboy hat. So uh, I, don't, I, I really don't have any idea. I'm just doing what I'm told. I, uh, but I'm excited about it. I'm from Texas. You know, but every, apparently everybody on the team now has, a, now has a hat. This is not necessarily my style, but uh, I'm happy to have a hat representing Texas. There you go. Um, high expectations for yourself trying to go for back-to-back -back wins in GTE AM. How, how does the pressure feel right now heading into the, the race next week? Yeah, so and I feel like every single car in a 24-hour race is a long shot. Uh, anything can happen, as Corvette knows from last year. You know, uh, uh, from their you know issue they had last year, anything can happen. Uh, it's it, so you know. I feel like the number one thing I need to do is take care of the car, uh, uh, and also try to be quick. Uh, uh, you know, if I can do that, then I feel really good uh, uh, about our chances. I look back on the last five years. I've been on the podium in four out of the last five years, which is something I'm really proud of, uh, knowing that it's difficult to have a perfect race, uh, to not have a, an issue or a penalty or anything. Uh, so that's what we're going for. If, if we can just have another perfect race, then I'm confident that everything will uh, work out. Uh, you know, we, we've got a great car, we've got a great team. Uh, all I can do is uh, try to do my job perfectly and uh, take care of the car. You know, the, uh, the strategy uh, I think will be a little bit different this year because the rules are a little bit different this year. I'm interested to see how that changes the race. You know, uh, uh, you know uh, I guess or, uh, I would say I'm interested to see how that changes the race and I'm also scared at how that changes the race uh, because I believe it changes the race. But uh, uh, yeah, uh, again, you know, all I can do is go out and take care of the car and try to be quicker than the other bronzes in my uh, six hours of drive time. And uh, you know, this is my ninth Le Mans in a row. Uh, I, I, I know how to get around here okay. And uh, uh, I'm looking forward to starting. All right, best of luck this next weekend. Yeah, thanks, John.